Hi everybody, it's Olivia Blanchard, the Brand Builder again. So uh, if, if you're a company that's currently working with a social media expert, consultant, guru, whatever, and you, you talk to them about how to measure social media ROI, return on investment, and they come back with an answer that includes Google Analytics uh, or stumble upon, or they give you keywords like, uh, well, we are increasing your influence or mind share or traffic to your website or participation in our blog posts, blah, blah, blah. Um, all these things are great. They're all impact, but they are not ROI. Return on investment and impact are two completely different things, and they've been used interchangeably for months in this conversation, and, and incorrectly so. And I think what's happened is there's been a disconnect between what a lot of bosses, managers, clients, business owners are asking for, which is show me the money of social media, prove to me that this is actually gonna improve my bottom line, not just now as a campaign, but over time, which is the promise of social media. Um, and what, what social media consultants who have no concept whatsoever of what ROI actually is or how to measure it are hearing show me impact on whatever you can. And so they're scrambling and using simple digital tools that they know to kind of tell their story. But ROI and impact are not the same. Eyeballs are not return on investment. Traffic to your website are not return on your investment. Uh, social mention is not return on investment. All of these things, all these digital things, all these types of impact, which can be measured directly and easily, do not constitute ROI. ROI is never digital, it is always financial. So repeat this after me, actually write it down. ROI, return on investment, is always financial. If you cannot tie your social media activities and all of these series of impacts back to a sales number, you are not measuring ROI and you don't understand what ROI is. So companies, all of you, if your social media consultant, expert, guru, whatever their nomenclature might be, doesn't understand the difference, that's red flag number one. Red flag number two is if when you confront them about it, they tell you, oh, you can't adequately or accurately measure the ROI of social media. It's impossible. They're lying to you. The truth is, what they should really be saying is, yes, you can, we just don't know how.